Hi everyone. Today I will show you how we can convert uh, 2D home drawing to 3D home drawing. Let's start. First we will uh, copy this one. For extrusion, we have to make a single entity of this, all the rooms here. For that, we will delete this window and we will add later on. To extrude, we have to make a single entity. For that, we have to use the reason command reg, then select all, enter, and you can see that now it is a single entity here. This one. Click on home here, and now we will extrude this one. Enter. Uh, we extrude the 2 d geometry to the 3 d geometry here. This is coming automatically because I already select the material from the material library. So I will type change properties here and click on uh, 3D visualization and material is here. I already select the few material here. and I will make a and I will change the material to so how we can select the material we have to click on visualize here then click on material browser select you have to click on autodesk library here and under this, we have material, different category, ceramic, concrete, default, flooring, glass, let's say flooring here. And if you like, this is American cherry, it will change this one, this one. So you select the material, right click and add to your favorite. Then automatically this material will be stored in your favorite here. We will cancel this one. And you can change the background here of the screen. We have to double click on a sun status here. Click on adjust exposure setting here. And here we have click on on and if you want to change the background click on background here we have none if you want to give any solid color here it, it will change to solids and if you want to give gradient it will change to this gradient you can choose your own color and if you want to attach your own images then click on image and that image will be show in the background I will set the gradient here and here you can set the exposure here click on exposure and bright and adjust the exposure here you you can adjust the exposure setting from here cancel this one so now I have a um, door block I will in, insert here Click on insert. Then I will cancel this one. I will click on top and I will come back to 2 d wireframe here. And here orbit. I will go 
move this door here so I forgot to ex uh, show you one point here when you choosing the material if you are in conceptual it will not show the material the material will show only if you click on realistic and we will we have to change the UCS for that click on top view wireframe for UCS click on face and select the top face accept We'll click on visualize here. And I will change the exposure. And now we will fill this gap here of this wall. We'll add a rectangle. We have to change the UCS open accept type rectangle here and now we will extrude this one same way we will we copy and we will use here a uh, press wool here click on press wool select on this face that's it same way we will copy and we will paste here and we will use press wool select this face escape So now we have few windows here and we will cut the windows uh, for that we have this one here first we will copy and we will paste here to cut a window we have to go on Studio wireframe here, and this side we have to create a, a window and cut out. We have to click on UCS, click face, and select this face and set. I will create a line here first, and I will create three feet wide. 3 feet a window here and 
and I will extrude this one. And now we will see in the conceptual. We have one, we have to move this one. For that, we have to change the UCS first. Click on face and select on top of this face. Set. Click on here. Right click, click on parallel. We will mirror this side now. No, we will copy this one. And here we click on to do wireframe. Again, we have to give a cutout here and align everything. We have to change the UCS. Click face and select this face. Accept. I will again create a line for reference here. Now I will click and move this object to the middle of this one. We will change the UCS again on the top of this one. And now click on conceptual and we will subtract these things. Here click on subtract, select this and this one this one, this one, and so we have one more, again click subtract, select, enter, and this one. So, in this way we cut some window and make a 3D view of this 2D drawing here. You can give the roof also. If For that, I will, you can give the roof as per your drawing. It may be a taper one or a rectangular. Can extrude here. And you can create a outer periphery if you want to, you know, extrude, then we will click, click press all, you know, we will come here
in here now we can create a boundary here This one. So in this way, you can create the boundaries of your roof. Here is this one. Maybe we will. And we will use a decimal here. This one also. So here we will make a union of this one and these roofs. This angle and Reno. If you now if you want to change the material in one shot, we can change the material. So in this way, we can convert a 2D drawing into 3D drawing. 